Welcome to the Brass Show and Vitamin where I keep it prolific, consistent, and dedicated for subscribers that have been subscribed to this channel for a long time. If you want your shout outs, all you gotta do is comment, share, subscribe, smash that bell, and turn on all my notifications. New subscribers will automatically get your shout outs. Remember, we only do six, so we can't. So if 20 people subscribe in a day, I can't get to all your shout outs in that day. Or I might because it depends on how many videos I do a day. But for current subscribers, older subscribers, or new subscribers, share, subscribe, smash that bell, and turn on all my notifications, and you will get your shout outs. So we're going to be talking about Kevin Owens and what WWE has canceled with Kevin Owens and why Vince McMahon banned the curb stomp. There's even more updates and developments on that. Even though the curb stomp has been banned for nearly a year now, we got more details on that right now. So right now, we're going to get to your shout outs, your comments, your opinions. David Sutherland, Justin Queen, Sean Bentley, Lamar's Show, um, Marquel Booker, and Crazy Kane. That's M-A-R-Q-U-I-L-E, Booker, and Crazy Kane, and Justin Queen. David Sutherland, Sean Bentley, and Lamar's Show. Remember, old, current, new subscribers... You, no matter what you are, you have to share, subscribe, smash that bell, and turn on all my notifications. And you will be realized, recognized, and respected. Now, according to the Argus leader, Kevin Owens on toning down the face of America. What is the WWE canceling for Kevin Owens? Is Kevin Owens turning face? Adjusting his promos, potential of turning face. Turning face, Kevin Owens says, I don't really know as far as any ideas or plans that anybody would have for that. I think that I can make anything work. If I can get people to boo me, then I can get people to cheer for me if I want. I'd be up for the challenge. Toning down the face of America catchphrase, uh, Kevin Owens said the following, I'm moving away from that by choice because there's so many people on SmackDown right now talking about America. Whether it's Jinder Mahal or Rusev, I don't like being like other people. When I started out as the face of America, there was nobody on SmackDown doing it and doing that kind of stuff. And now... There's too many of us, and I'm going to go back to being Kevin Owens, and that's what's always worked out best for me. And you know what? Kevin Owens is a guy that already stands out above and beyond the crowds. Kevin Owens is already different. Kevin Owens is not one of those guys that, you know, you pick out with, you know, the Seth Rollins, the Jinder Mahals. You know, Kevin Owens is built from a different kind of stature, so to speak. Kevin Owens is already different from his look and how he carries himself and how he talks. So by default, Kevin Owens is already different, but Kevin Owens doesn't want to be that cookie cutter like everybody else, and I can respect that out of Kevin Owens. There's no doubt about that. Viewers and subscribers, remember, new and older subscribers, smash that bell and subscribe and turn on all my notifications and share my videos all over Facebook and Twitter. Seth Rollins on why Vince McMahon burned a band, the curb stop, and changed his entrance theme Source, Sam Roberts, Wrestling Podcast. Wrestling Podcast, professional broadcaster and pro wrestling enthusiast, Sam Roberts, Sam Roberts recently spoke one-on-one -on -one with one half of the WWE Tag Team Champion, Seth Rollins. And among other things, Rollins discussed his new entrance music, why he had to stop using the curb stop as a finish, and who he would select as a tag team partner if The Shield needed a female member. Very interesting here, viewers and subscribers. On the subject of his new entrance music, Rollins shared that WWE Champion Vince McMahon did not like the long pause in the song and finally decided to do something about it. The King Slayer explained that he had a handful of variant versions of his existing theme from which to choose from and went with the best option available. According to Rollins, he was very... Get back in focus. He was very sad when he was told that he could no longer do the curb stop and divulged that the most... That the move will never come back. CrossFit Jesus, Seth Rollins says, McMahon did not think the finish was a good way for Rollins to represent the company. And once again, ladies and gentlemen, the PG, it, it is, you know, family friendly. I know you bring kids, but I mean, I think there's a lot thing, a lot more things that are violent and volatile than the curb stop. And, and we all know that this stuff is scripted. And I, and we know that it's, it's it, I wouldn't call, I, like I said, I, I, I don't like when fans call wrestling or wrestling fans fake or a facade. Um, but you know, it, it, it's, we know it's predetermined. We know it's planned. We, we know the wrestlers tried to protect one another. So it's not like Seth Rollins is doing it in a way to, um, you know, end another guy. He, he's doing it as a finisher. And then Seth Rollins went on to say, I heard it before the show two or three weeks ago, my, my theme. And uh, the first time it debuted. Yeah, it was weird. Uh, it was a weird thing where I got to, when I got to raw that day, Rollins is told, we need to do something with your music. What do you mean? I've been using the same song for like three years. Well, what's the problem? Well, Vince doesn't like that pause. He has been hearing the same music for three years. What are we talking about? So they played five different entrance themes of them songs. And one of them said Kingslayer. And it was very seductive, almost like Whispers Kingslayer. So like 
the burn it down was the best option available. So I was like, okay, do it. But it actually worked out very well. And last week, they put the fire in my entrance video. So I was like, all right, whatever. So you got Kevin Owens transitioning from the face of America, perhaps taking on the challenge of being a face. And that would be a different change of pace for Kevin Owens, the former United States champion, the former WWE Universal champion. And then you got Seth Rollins talking about the curb stop being banned and how he was very sad. I think not only Seth Rollins was sad, but we were all, quite frankly, very sad that Seth Rollins had to have that go away. And Seth Rollins, quite frankly, I mean, that's what made Seth Rollins. That's what made him different. That's what made him stand out. That's what made him be able to hit that move on anyone at any time. Now Seth Rollins has to simply use a knee to the face, which is okay, which is cool, but it just doesn't have that kind of image and effect that the curb stump did. So ladies and gentlemen, your comments and your opinions, share, subscribe, and remember, smash that bell and turn on all my notifications so you're always in the know on all rumors, news, and headlines in WWE. Your shoutouts are coming next. Subscribe. Stay tuned for more of The Brash One.